Welcome to Reality Creator Alchemy. I'm Tom. Today, we're going to make ice cream the alchemist way. Normally, this experiment is made with two plastic bags. You take a gallon plastic bag, you put the ice slush mix, salt, ice slush salt mix in there, and then you take a, no, a smaller plastic bag and put the ice cream in the smaller bag, put the two bags together, and you knead them together until it makes ice cream. It uh, works on a... Now, to make ice cream the alchemist way, we're going to use something called freezing point depression. The actual ice cream mixture, okay, uh, here's the, the recipe for the ice cream mixture, and that's over here in my little beaker, my 250 milliliter beaker, mixing up right now on this stirrer. Now what happens is if we chill, we can chill this stuff down to below 20 degrees F, it, the ice cream will start to freeze. And I'm hoping we're gonna have some nice custard style ice cream in the process. So to do that, we're going to surround this, be this small beaker with in this bucket here with water, and ice and what will happen is the because we have I have salt dissolved in here I have 175 milligrams of salt dissolved in here which is the maximum roughly the maximum amount of salt that you can have in 500 milliliters of water so that means that the freezing point of this water is going to be much lower than 32 degrees so in fact I'm hoping it's going to be around 16 or 15 degrees Fahrenheit and then we're going to hopefully we're going to fill we're going to you know, once we put the ice in here we're going to hopefully transfer that cold thing to the beaker on the inside get that below 20 degrees f and start to make ourselves some ice cream so now let's just start the the magic i'm going to go get the ice and we'll start the process be right back all right got my ice got my stuff Turn this off for a minute. I'm going to put this here and put the beaker in the middle like this. And then we're going to take the ice cubes, put them all the way. And of course, you just can't surround this with ice cubes. Is not going to be able to. We're not going to be able to transfer the coal into here. So we put as much ice in here as we possibly can. All right. Turn this. I'm going to turn the. Uh, I'm going to turn on the stirrer, all right, and now we're going to add the salt water mixture on the outside of this beaker. And by the way, if you have crushed ice, this would, this would work better with crushed ice. Let's get it up to the tippy top. And really now it's just going to be, it's going to be a waiting game at this point with, um, Waiting for the temperature of the water to drop and the temperature of the cream in the cup to drop. So we'll I'll just have to wait and see. And what I'll do is I'll come back in a little while. Okay, here's the update. The water is down to 10 degrees. Well, on this particular one, 12.2. But there are spots that are 10. And the ice cream is starting to get hard. Now the ice cream temperature is at uh, 22 degrees F. It's definitely, I have to keep turning the stirrer up faster and faster because the ice cream is getting thick. All right, as far as laboratory work goes, this is exciting stuff here, let me tell you. All right, we're into 24 minutes into the process. I just shot some footage of the inside of this beaker to show you how thick it is and I'll show you show you that here this ice cream is getting thick look at this look at this we are actually making ice cream the alchemist way we're gonna let this i'm gonna let this keep going and get it a little thicker right now i think it's still a little soupy i'd like to get a little creamier the stirrer is having a hard time keeping up as you can see the beaker is now spinning because the stuff the solids are getting so thick that it is now spinning the, the fluid along with the with the stirrer and I keep having to readjust the stirrer and I've had to uh, right here's another breaking update 
We're at 29 minutes and we got clumps of ice cream forming in the top of this mixture. Absolutely amazing. Let's see how I'm at 32 minutes in the process. The stirrer has pretty much gave in, it has the only thing the stirrer can do now is spin the thing around because it does stuff is too thick for the stirrer to even do. So I have to have to get in there and I gotta mix it with manually with the glass stirrer. But just to let you guys know, the water temperature is an unbelievable uh, 10 degrees, 10 point, and the ice cream temperature is at 18 degrees. Man, that is absolutely excellent. And it is ice cream. I mean, it is pretty much maybe a little thinner than soft serve ice cream at this point. I'm going to let it go for a little while longer because, okay, I'm at 51 minutes and we got ice cream. I'm actually calling an end to this experiment. I'm sure I can get this ice cream even thicker and harder than it is now, but right now I got it at soft serve amount. And I want to get it out of this beaker and put it in a cup and put it in the refrigerator, freezer and freeze it the rest of the way so I can have like a nice ice cream dessert tonight for myself. But um, let's taste it. Mm, wow. Woo. I don't know, think I could buy ice cream ever again. Anyway, that's how it's done, guys. That's how we make ice cream. The alchemist way. And because you made it with love and your alchemy skill, it's going to taste that much better. Trust me. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. And as always, if you made it to the end of this video, you earned yourself a cool. And it's cool, isn't it?